So what we're going to do today is just a general bit of a mow, just a bit of a tidy up of the yard. Um, I'll take you through the uh, process that I will adopt for that. Multifaceted, of course. Look, we can't just come out and do a mow, that'd be pretty boring, right? Got to do a few extras and a few other bits and bobs. So let me just uh, show you the grass here. It's a little bit longer than it should be. Oh, it's been about six days since it's last cut. Oh, let's get you down and intimate with that. Give you a proper look. She's getting a little bit long. I dare say she's well above the 60 millimeter mark. By the time we're done, we'll have her back down to the 25 millimeter mark. What do you reckon? Do you agree? Yeah. Yeah, cool. I need photos. You need photos? Yeah. We're making a video. I'm my video. Okay, so just to take you through the order of proceedings today uh, for the general mow. Just that. Gonna start out with a bit of a whippersnip here. Look, I mainly need to snip along this deck edge that you can see just behind me, but also just do a little bit of a trim around the perimeter of the yard, just because you can't quite get the mower right to the edge. Um, I like to do the whippersnip first because that flicks up all of the grass and allows you to, uh, to clean it up with the mower a little bit later on so you don't have to do as much uh, blowing if you choose to do that um, after you mow. Second to that, we're going to do a little bit of edging with the Ryobi 18 volt edger here. Um, I've got cotton steel edging running around the edge of this buffalo, so um, this works really well, the 18 volt edger, just to zip around and uh, clean up that edge just to get it nice and trim. Uh, it gives it a really tight sort of finished look. Uh, and following that, we're going to adopt ye old rotary. Um, the reason I use the rotary is just to get a bit of that length down. Obviously buffalo is quite a thick grass, um, so the cylinder mower wouldn't love to run through the thick, uh, long, dense grass that the buffalo is at the moment but it also picks up a lot of debris maybe if there's some stones or there's some twigs or um, something that the cylinder mower wouldn't really like to go over um, that's where this bad boy comes into play yeah buddy and then finally the piece of resistance the finishing move the conor mcgregor the rover 45 real mower just to come in and give it that nice smooth excellent manicured polished finish give it some stripes Let's go guys, tight stripes. Yeah. Oh, Safety first guys, we recommend that you always wear proper PPE when mowing the lawn. Uh, protective boots are a must whether they be frozen boots or pink gum boots. going to do a quick test across all sections of the blade here just to double check that the uh, the reel has proper contact with the bed knife um, and make sure it's cutting across the whole length of the blade. I want it to be thicker. Yeah. It's thicker! It will and that's cutting thicker. perfectly right along the whole blade. So we won't need to do any adjustments there, that's um, ready to go. Starts first time every time. Don't make a liar out of me. Let's do this. Yeah. Right, I'm just 
just going to engage the reel. Now we're ready to start mowing. done. Oh, look at that. Pretty tidy, if I'm going to say so myself. Just went the uh, single stripe configuration, up and down. Started going for some diamonds in the middle there. Probably can't quite see them. Only got a bit over it. Time is precious these days when you're a family man. I get back on the nest, hang out with my beautiful family. But the lawn's done now. Fantastic. Have a look at that. Beautiful. Thanks for watching guys. Be sure to subscribe and like the content. Tell your friends. Tune in next time to Lawn Dreams. Tight stripes guys.